Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome here to Verocla, Ken Manning, Western Wisconsin Video Productions, as we're ready to bring you today's basketball game. It's a non-conference girls game featuring the Brookwood Falcons and the Verocla Blackhawks, as the Blackhawks host the Falcons here. Teams coming out onto the court. Take a look here at uh, the starters for Brookwood, Vanessa Anderson, Ruby Mullenkamp, Reagan Mullenkamp, Kylie Powell, and Kimber Kaiser. Here's the jump ball, and this game is underway. Falcons with the uh, opening possession here. This is Anderson kicking it out to Kaiser. Kaiser looking now, driving on the baseline. Comes back out behind to Ruby Mullenkamp. Ruby back up to the top of the key and fires over to the far side to Powell. And she'll slow things down. Again, the starters... Let's take a look. Here's the baseline move. Back out the top here. Tipped a little bit, but Kaiser able to recover. Inside to Kaiser. Her shot is up over the top. No good. And the rebound coming away here by Dregny. Dregny, Hubach, Moylene, Dio, and Quackenbush, the starters here. There's a drive. That was uh, number 14 in uh, Rachel Dio, and she's going to be fouled. So Rachel will go to the line here and shoot a couple of buckets, see if she can get the early lead here. That one just off to the left-hand side, no good. Well, these two teams, they've uh, met in the past. They've always had some pretty good contests. Second shot, just a tad bit strong off the back of the rim. And that ball touched, I believe that was Kaiser with the touch. And it will be back to the Blackhawks. They will inbound underneath their own basket. Got to get it in. They do. And here's a shot up. And oh, another foul is going to be called here on the play. That one... That one might have went against uh, Reagan Mullenkamp. So Hubach at the line. Her first shot is off the mark. 0 for 3 right now. Need to break the ice for the Blackhawks. And that one will snap through the netting. Falcons coming back down the court here, as you can see, 1-0 the lead. And the ball is going to go out of bounds off from that shot. No one could get to the rebound. As far as the Falcons are concerned, trying to direct traffic out there. They do finally get the ball in. Falcons coming up with some man-to-man -man defense here right now. Hubach with a nice bounce pass over to Moylene, and she was trying to get the pass over in that far corner, and missed her teammate. Out of bounds it goes. Brookwood with the inbound. And they'll look to walk it across. The timeline, able to do that. Here's a three on the way. That was Anderson, no, and a rebound. Coming down here to the Falcons, and then a scramble underneath. Looks like we're going to get a foul called here. And now the question is, who is that foul on? Up on the board, they have number two, which would be Dregny. Maybe that's who it went up against. First team foul here. That ball tipped out of bounds. Anderson with the inbound play once again. Vanessa Anderson, a four-year starter here for the Falcons. Here's a shot up. That's no good. Kaiser with a nice rebound. We are going to get a jump ball. Well, I'll tell you what, uh, Quackenbush did a great job in there to uh, get to the ball and battle with Kaiser to get the jump ball situation. Here's an ounce pass. And coming back here. This is Moylene inside Quackenbush, and that's going to be two 
And we have a timeout. Well, coming back off from that timeout, the Falcons with the ball. It'll be Ruby Mullenkamp to inbound. And it'll be Anderson on the receiving end as they get this play going. Kind of a half-court mini press, we'll call it, by the Blackhawks. They get the ball across the timeline. Anderson comes up here back to the top of the key with Powell, and she'll go down underneath. I checked that that was Mullenkamp, actually. There's Powell here on the wing. Inside to Kaiser, and Dregney will create some problems there and got the turnover. Anderson with the tip. Now let's see, did that go off the foot? It did go off the foot of Moyne-Lean, and the Falcons will come away with the, with the uh, turnover themselves. Here's Anderson for three. That's off the back of the rim, and out of bounds. Blackhawks with the ball. Deal to inbound. To Moyne-Lean. And now they'll get it across here. That was a deal once again inside. Here's a tie-up with Reagan Mullenkamp and Quackenbush. And the arrow favors Brookwood. Anderson with the ball over here to the near side. Mullenkamp swinging around. Now they go down low. They'll kick it back out. In the game here, number 10, uh, Reagan Mullenkamp with the uh, pass back out. And the Falcons start all over again. And go back inside to Mullenkamp. They'll kick it out. Here's a shot up. Rimmed in and out. No good. And uh, Ruby Mullenkamp with the rebound point. There's a battle underneath with Dregney. Dregney doing a nice job tonight here as uh, she's made her presence known right away. Getting to the ball. 3 nothing to score here yet as the uh, Blackhawks picking up a free throw. There's going to be a turnover. Could not get the ball in. Free throw and a field goal. To have this early 3 0 lead. Well, the defense for the Falcons came through. Falcons with the inbound underneath their own basket to Anderson up to the top with Mullenkamp. Mullenkamp tries to feed it in low, and there's Dregney once again. Haley Dregney with a nice play as they take off to the other end. And we're going to get, looks like a foul down low. Drag me with a nice drive, but she is fouled on the play. Let's see if we can catch who that uh, foul was on here in just a moment. Haley to the line, and she'll get a couple of shots here. First shot is no good. Actually, the second one, I should say. <laughs> and uh, she did get the first. It's four. Nothing here. Here's a shot up. Oh, wow. Big time shot. That one uh, coming up. I believe that that was uh, 21 in uh, Deanna Wallace hitting the bucket and have... Uh, Turn over here now for the Falcons. It's 4-3, Barocca. Wallace coming in and hitting a shot from downtown in that uh, right corner. Shot is up off the front of the rim. No, rebound coming back. Kubach with the drive. That shot is off the mark. And off the backboard in the front of the rim. Brooklyn coming right back down as quick as possible. And we're going to get a foul here. Kate Quackenbush holding her ground here with Kaiser trying to drive, but they're going to say that 
Quackenbush is going to be called for the foul, it looks like. No, they don't have that up on the board. They actually are saying it's on Dregny. So Dregny must have snuck in from the side and created the foul. Quackenbush in pretty good position defensively. 4-4 the score now as Kaiser hits the first. Only the second team foul on the Blackhawks. Second shot is no good and rebound tipped around and coming away with it somehow is Reagan uh, or check that. Uh, yeah, it was Reagan, I believe. Reagan Mullenkamp or was it Ruby? It was Ruby. Number four. Ball tipped out of bounds. Good hands there by the Blackhawks. Rookwood with the ball up here to Wallace in the near side, down in the corner, and back up to Mullenkamp. Here's a, a Reagan Mullenkamp. The shot by Anderson, no, back of the rim, and Reagan coming away with it. Reagan Mullenkamp with the rebound, but then tipped, but then off the hand of Mullenkamp. Morocco with the ball. Well, 6 4 your score here. You get the ball in. This is 24 in Sam Schneider into the ball game. Moylene with a nice bounce pass here to the near side with Rachel Deal at the free throw line. She stops, tries to pop that one in on the bank shot. It does not go. Broke lug with the rebound and then now tipped out of bounds by Kaiser on the defense. Trying to get that bounce pass back up to the top with Moylene. And Kaiser just did get her hand on it. Kate Quackenbush coming back into the ball game. Rozeski in the game. Hubach with the inbound to Quackenbush. Bounce pass inside and couldn't quite get it to uh, Rozeski. And then Mullenkamp coming away, away with the steal, but she steps out of bounds. Well, the Blackhawks catching a break here. Let's see if they can capitalize on the inbound. That ball tipped by Mullenkamp in Ruby. Now the inbound, Hubach gets it into Rozeski. Bounce pass down low. They'll come back out to the top with Moylene. Up on the wing. At, uh, let's see who's into the game. I believe that's Christensen now. It is. Alana Christensen in the game. Ball heading out of bounds. Oh, good track down there. Boy, that was nice hustle there. Both these teams playing hard. Mullenkamp coming away with that one, and now the ball blocked on the uh, potential shot. And we're going to get a reach in as Barocqua came out of that mess. That was Moylene, and I think she might have been fouled by Anderson. We'll have to wait and see. Moylene comes out of the ball game. Deal is in. Along with Hubach. Here's a three on the way, back of the rim. No, nice rebound, good follow here by Deal. On the pass, picked off by Kaiser. And the lead pass out in front here to Mullenkamp and some nice defense once again. That was Christensen with the defense. Popping the ball away. But the Brookwood Falcons will inbound. Here's Anderson, her shot, a little too strong. Kaiser with the big rebound here herself, back to Anderson. Now Mullenkamp on the drive, kicks it out to Wallace. And, uh, well, Deanna just wasn't quite ready for that one as the ball was off to the right just a touch, and it goes out of bounds. A couple of changes here for the teams. Mullenkamp comes out. That is Reagan. We didn't quite catch who came in. We'll see if we can get that here in just a moment. Looks like it's Kylie Powell back into the ball game. Here's a shot by Emily Hubach. Just a touch strong once again. Nice rebound by Quackenbush. Put back 
No, Quackenbush getting a rebound, but we're going to get a foul down low. And uh, that foul is going to go against the Blackhawks. Here's Anderson, three-quarter press coming up here now. Still a 6-4 score. Shot is up by Mullenkamp, no. And Hubach, she came flying in, picking up that rebound. Quick pass over the far side, it goes. Back up to top with Deal, her shot, no good. Quackenbush trying to get position, but blocked out. Here's Anderson on the drive, that layup is good. And just like that, it's 8-4, your score with a timeout. Well, as we come back off from that timeout, as you can see, 8-4, your score here. Rokla, the inbound, they'll do that for Rachel Deal. Rachel coming across the timeline. Far side it goes. That was Hubach and Deal playing catch. Bounce pass inside, Kaiser picked it off. Kaiser kind of read that one pretty well. And back down the court, and looks like we are going to get a foul here on the play. That foul is going to go on number 21 in Kate Quackenbush. Anderson puts that one down. Fifth, fourth team foul here for the Blackhawks. Anderson hits both. 10-4 your score here as we hit the nine minute mark of this first half action. Down the court they come, Blackhawks. Here's Dregney and she's gonna be fouled on the nice push here to the bucket. Well, you gotta be aggressive and Haley Dregney doing a nice job of that. She'll go to the line Shot is up and good. She'll get another one. One for two here. Coming down, this is Powell with a nice rebound. She brings it down the court. Goes inside to Kaiser from Wallace, back up to the top, picked off again. The defense by the Blackhawks getting that one and now a turnover coming back for Brookwood and tracking the ball down. That was Powell over in that far corner. Inside they go to Wallace. She is going to take the shot. No, second one up. And that's going to be a foul here. That might go on Quackenbush is what it looks like. So Deanna Wallace will go to the line here for a couple of shots. Let's see if she can put him down. That is the fifth team foul now for Barocla. That shot off the front of the rim, no good. Meanwhile, for the Falcons, they have six team fouls, so the next foul that they create will put the Blackhawks on the line in a one-on-one -on -one situation. Quackenbush comes out of the ball game. That shot will roll around and drop through for Wallace. And it's 11-5, Brookwood. Hubach with the inbound. She'll get the ball back across the timeline from Deal. Deal wants to go to the right-hand side, double teamed over there. Back up to the top, here's Dregneef, and a nice shot here at the free throw line. She banks it in, 11-7 at the eight minute mark of the first half. Mullenkamp got stuck in traffic. Shot is up off from the pass. No good. And Dregney will come away with it. Dregney gets the ball across the timeline into Deal. Here's Emily Hubach with the shot. That's over the top, a little too strong. Right into the hands of the Falcons. Down the court comes Mullenkamp. She passes. Baseline move. Anderson, no. 
or check that, Ruby and Reagan Mullenkamp. They were the sister act there, working together. And it was Ruby who came up short on the shot underneath. And the foul call will go back the other way here in the one and one situation. Now we talked about that just a moment ago that you had some problems here with uh, the Blackhawks sitting on 16 fouls. So that was kind of a tough situation for them. Not able to get the free throw. Falcons coming away with it. Here's Anderson on the spin. Again, they have 17 fouls. Blackhawks not able to convert on that. The shot is going to be an air ball underneath. Goroqua. Looking inbound. Rozeski into the game. They get it to her. Back out. It comes right away to Dio. She steps across the uh, end line. And down the court they go. Seven minutes here in the half. Well, the foul underneath here and going to the line is Emma Moilene. I'll tell you what, there is a you got a couple of spark plugs there for the Blackhawks with Moylene and Hubach, Rachel Deal. Dragney in there. Blackhawks doing a nice job here. They continue to work. And they're up against, uh, we're going to get a timeout here. They are up against a team with a little more uh, senior leadership, I guess I would say, uh, by the Falcons. Well, the Falcons will look to inbound here off from the timeout. And they'll come back across with Mullenkamp down to Kaiser. Kaiser in the lane, lost the handle, but tipping it to Mullenkamp was Anderson. Now Kaiser down low, not able to get that on the drop, and Rozeski pulling down the rebound. She went up strong for that one. And Lily comes away with a rebound, and we're going to get a foul called here on Kaiser. And we got to go all the way back to the other direction here, as that was the ninth team foul now on the Falcons here in the first half. So Lily Rozeski will be on the line, getting the one and one. That ball no good in the rebound. We're going to get a jump ball here. Gregney and Mullenkamp locked up. Mullenkamp trying to rip the ball away, and Gregney doing a nice job here of getting her hands on the ball. Rozeski up to the top. That was Hubach. Now Dio. Mullenkamp guarding her. Ruby staying close. Nearly came away with a tip. Now the defense swarming in on Rachel. And we're going to get a timeout here. Or was that a turnover? Excuse me, it was a turnover. Five-second call. Tough defense by the Falcons. Well, as you can see, the clock still sitting there. We're in that six-minute range. Ball tipped back in, and there's a good hustle play. By Baroqua. Coming down the court. Here's Rozeski inside, and she laid it up and in. Well, good position there by Lily Rozeski, and she was able to bank that shot in. We got a ball game at 11 10. Brookwood. Ball tipped out of bounds, uh, tipped or stopped from going out of bounds, and boy, popping that one up and in. Falcons back up by three. Pretty good hustle play <laughs> again. By both teams. Here comes Rozeski again, and she laid it up and in. Two in a row for Lily Rozeski. And a takeaway. Dregney, her shot up, no good. Rebound coming up here by the Falcons. That is Reagan Mullenkamp. And a timeout. 
Well, that timeout was called by the Falcons head coach Travis Anderson watching the track race taking place and he wanted to slow things down a little bit as Blackhawks only trail by one here. It's 13-12. Again, we're hitting the five minute mark as you can see in the upper part portion of your screen. Wallace down low here in the corner, back up to Ruby Mullenkamp. They'll play catch. Reagan and Ruby were doing that. Now it's going to be Powell. Mullenkamp over the far side. Anderson with a pretty good look, but that ball is off to the right, no good. Powell had to bounce off her leg, and eventually we're going to get a jump ball here. Well, that ball rolling around with everybody, and they finally are going to get the uh, jump ball at the 426 mark. Here's Powell. She'll look inside and instead bounce back out to Mullenkamp, down low. Falcons moving the ball around pretty well. Here's Anderson again. She's got a great look this time. And she pops that one through the netting. A three-pointer at 16-12 with four minutes to go in the half. Hubach up to the top here with Marlene. Back to Christensen, who is now in the game. Shot a little bit too strong. Quackenbush pulling that rebound away from everybody. Christensen wanted to go up for the shot, and I think we got ourselves a foul here. On the reach end, let's see if we can pick up who that was on. I'm not 100%, but Quack, uh, excuse me, uh, Christensen will be going to the line. Well, on his first shot is no good as it rimmed out, but she'll get a second here. That shot is strong off the back of the rim. Falcons coming away with it. That was Mullenkamp. And now we're going to get a reach in from behind with Christensen. It was four against four. And that time the foul is going to go on the uh, white team, the home team here in Viroqua. Anderson over the far side. Powell thought about the three. Goes into Mullenkamp. Mullenkamp wanted to go right back inside to Powell, who had set up position, but the ball tipped by the defense of Varroqua. Pretty good hands there once again. Back up to the top with Powell. Down that far corner. Whoa, from way downtown, it's Anderson in the corner. Baseline corner, she hits another three. 19-12, and now Powell with some hustle there on her own. Tips that one out of bounds. Well, good to see Kylie Powell back out there on the floor. She had turned the ankle a little bit uh, a while back and had to set out a game or two. Ball tipped out of bounds, but on the tip, a foul was called. So Kate Quackenbush will go to the line. And we should be in the double bonus now. Ten team fouls here on Brookwood. First shot is up and a little strong on the back of the iron. But Kate will get another try. This one, uh, wow, the same spot. But a big rebound by Christensen. Gets it out to Deal. Deal in a little trouble, trying to get it over to Moylene. She does do that. And a bounce pass just behind Christensen. Now the Falcons with the inbound. They'll go to Mullenkamp. Yep, there's going to be an over and back. Mullenkamp to Mullenkamp, but Reagan on the pass back to her sister. 
needed to wait just a half a count here because Ruby was still on the wrong side of the court. Now they'll have to give the ball up. Christensen trying to reach in here and create some problems. We are going to get, that is uh, Mullenkamp, or check that was that Anderson. It might have been Anderson in there. We are going to get a jump ball. It stays with Varopa. Deal with the inbound. She'll come way out to the top here with Moylene. Moylene back inside the, the uh, half court. That ball off the leg of Anderson. Hubach, good shot here, and that's going to be a little strong on the back. And rebound. There's going to be another scramble. And it just rolls out of bounds. Last touch by Moylene. I tell you what, uh, you've got, uh, as I said before, you've got some spark plugs here. And coach, head coach Terry Cena with a young bunch for the Blackhawks. He's got some uh, good people to work with here. Though they trail right now to the little more experienced senior uh, squad here of the Falcons. You've got Anderson, Powell, and Kaiser as seniors here for the Falcons. Turnaround shot, bank that one in. Wow, Kylie Powell for two, and it's 21-12. All of a sudden, it's uh, well, it's about what an eight old run here, as that ball is thrown out of bounds, trying to get it down low quickly. The Blackhawks were into the ball game now uh, for the Blackhawks is Miranda Art, number 14. She comes in. 8-0 run. It was 13-12. Right around that 4-30 mark. Powell with the bounce pass out to Kaiser. Back inside to Powell on the baseline. She wanted to go up with a layup and she's going to be fouled here on the body by Quackenbush. Well, she got just inside position enough and Kate coming over on that defensive uh, swing and she just caught Powell with the body. 150 to go here in the half. Powell's shot is up and no good. She'll get a second though, as she was in the act of shooting. Mullenkamp back into the game. Shot is up, no good. Bounce pass, nice uh, rebound here by the way from Moylene, got great inside position. Anderson with the near steal. Moylene on the throw and it winds up into the hands of Mullenkamp. She did see Mullenkamp who quietly kind of reached that hand out and was able to pick it off. Minute and a half to go and we're gonna get a foul underneath. This is gonna go on Emma Moylene, so Ruby Mullenkamp will go to the line. Her first shot is up and good. Extending that lead to 10 and looking for 11. That's too strong back of the rim and a nice job position wise getting that rebound by Dregney over to Deal. And the Blackhawks continue here with the drive. Let's see if they can get something to uh, to go here. Back up here to Christensen. And, or check that. That was Dregney over there. And the defense is going to create a turnover by the Falcons. Powell over to Mullenkamp. Baseline, here's a shot up. No. That was uh, Ruby Mullenkamp and Rozeski coming away with a rebound again. Nice uh, job there by Lily Rozeski. Here's the drive from uh, Hubach. I tell you what, that's what you have to do. You take it to the rack. And uh, Emily will go to the line here and shoot a couple off from a foul.
First shot is off the mark here, not able to drop through. And the second one is true. Down the court we go. Here's Kaiser. Back to Kaiser from Wallace. Now back over on the far side, Powell to Mullenkamp. Mullenkamp to Mullenkamp. Reagan dropping back out and goes to Kaiser. Kaiser left alone. Her shot is off to the left, no good. And Roseski coming away with a rebound here. And she was fouled with 25 seconds remaining. No, back the other way once again. Now they put up on the board that the uh, foul was on uh, Kylie Powell, it looks like. Zeski's first shot, not able to go, just off on the angle to the left side. Kaiser will come out. Anderson's going to come in down low here. Zeski shot, a little strong, and tipped around, and Reagan Mullenkamp comes away with it. She brings the ball across the timeline. Here comes Ruby with a three, rimmed in and out, and then it dropped through. My goodness, 25-13. A 12-1 run here in the last uh, four and a half minutes of this ball game in the first half here has put the Falcons on top by a solid margin right now. But the Blackhawks, they're going to continue the battle in the last seconds. And, of course, we still have second half action coming up. Get the ball in. And they're going to look for the shot. Not able to get that. And the steal here by Barocla to end the half. We'll take a break and come back with second half action. Back we come to Viroqua, Ken Manning, Western Wisconsin Video Productions. And again, thanks to those sponsors that we'll see every once in a while, helping to bring you today's ball game. And thanks to Mia Anderson for taping today's ball game. Falcons with the ball back up to the top here. They have first, uh, first chance here, we'll call it, in the second half. They did put on quite the run, a 13-1 to outburst with four and a half to go in the half to have this advantage over the Blackhawks. They're taking their time here, being a little more deliberate here. Here's Anderson for three in front of the rim. No, Mullenkamp with a big rebound. Kind of snuck in there. Here's Kaiser, should kick it out. Reagan, Mullenkamp, she'll hit the baseline shot. Well, maybe about a 10-footer there, and she drained it. And now the pass, quick pass, trying to get over here on the near side. Looked like they were trying to hit Deal coming down this near sideline, and they overshot her. 27-13, if I saw the score right there. Mullenkamp into Kaiser on the free throw line. Lob pass back out to the top. Down on that left side. Quick pass. Here's a bank. And that's good. And that was Kylie Powell. Banking that one in. Marlene trying to get across the timeline. And the ball tipped away by Anderson. 29-13 your score here as the Falcons slowly pulling away. Here's Dregny off from the inbound. Trying to make a little bit of a move here. Goes to Moylene. Moylene top of the key. Down low. Nice bounce pass into Kate Quackenbush. I think that was, uh, was that Moylene over there in the far corner? That was, uh, regardless, that was a very nice bounce pass. I believe it was. Powell to Mullenkamp on the baseline. She's got to come back out to Kylie. 
and uh, now Mullenkamp into Kaiser and Powell. They've kind of played the little triangle here. Brooklyn sitting back. A little bit of a zone here. Here's a shot up, no, and uh, we're going to get a jump ball, Kaiser, and Deal locked up. Kaiser will come out of the ball game, see if we can catch who came in for Brookwood in just a moment. Deal with the long pass to the far side, back up to Moylene. Moylene on the drive. Kicks it out. Hubach, boy, did she nail that one. Emily Hubach from way downtown, and she drilled it. Here's Powell to Mullenkamp. Back up to Wallace. Quick step. That was Powell. Back to Powell. Mullenkamp over to the far side. She goes toward the score bench. Now Powell inside Wallace. Again, your little triangle of action. Skip pass to Powell. Comes Anderson, free throw lane. No good on the shot by Powell. And running that one down is Dragney. And... Haley is just going to step out of bounds as she tried to scoop around that double team. That was being put on by Brooklyn. Here's Anderson again. That shot, no good. And the rebound coming away. Falcons maintain possession. Mullenkamp kicks it out here at the left. Back to Mullenkamp. And back to the top of the key. Here is Ruby with a shot. That's no good. And rebound coming up by Reagan. Her shot, no good. Ball is trying to get in there. But Emma uh, Moilene was uh, just in too good a position there. And she was able to pull down the rebound. And now the turnover here as Brookwood uh, checked that. It thought it was going to be a turnover. There's still some discussion here. But it will be Viroqua basketball. Quackenbush coming out. Dregney is out. Looks like Moylene took a break. Christensen comes in. So you have Dio Rozeski. Hubach. And Schneider out there on the floor. So Rozeski, Christensen, Schneider, Deal, and Hubach. There we go. 29-17, still trying to battle here. Stay in this ball game, the Blackhawks. 13.45 to go in the contest. This ball ripped out of the hands of Christensen. And now the ball tipped away by Christensen. Anderson will do uh, the majority of inbound plays, passing the ball in. Shot no good. Kaiser, little hook shot no good. Rebound still not going to fall. And now we're going to get a foul here as Kaiser goes to the ground. Well, taking a look here, Kaiser, they will say, was she in the act of shooting? They're going to say, no, she was not. Again, Anderson underneath the Falcon basket gets the ball into play. Back up to the top with Kaiser for a Powell. Top of the key, a three by Mullenkamp. My goodness, she shot from way downtown. He is building her confidence when it comes to shooting those threes. 
Here's Christensen. Nice try here. Rebound by Deal. Out to Rzeski. Her shot off the back. No good on the right side. And coming away with it is Reagan Mullenkamp. Reagan down the sideline here to Ruby. Ruby trying to make the drive. The shot is up and good. All of a sudden, five quick points here for Ruby Mullenkamp. Deal has that one bounce away. And they're going to say that, uh, officials say that Rachel was the last to touch it. Mullenkamp to Mullenkamp and back. Ruby walking the ball across. We'll go inside to Anderson, back out. Another shot up and good again. Ruby Mullenkamp all of a sudden on fire with eight straight points here for the Falcons. Hitting a three and extending the lead here for Brookwood on the home court of the Viroqua Blackhawks. They'll get the ball in to Christensen here on the near side. Back over the top it goes to Hubach. On the wing, shot is up, no. Uh, the putback by Rozeski, no good. She got her own rebound. And that is going to be bounced off the foot of Reagan Mullenkamp. So Varroquit with, with the inbound. Looking for some help, and they find it in Schneider. Schneider goes down low, and a nice turnaround shot here by Rozeski. Just had a little too much on it. And rebound, Brookwood. And now Rozeski is going to be called for the foul. Ball bounced right into the hands of the Falcons, and Lily trying to be the, the, the competitor that she is. She swatted at the ball and caught the Falcons on the arm. Shot is up, around, and good. Well, right now, the Falcons are not doing anything wrong. Well, the timeout here coming up. 39-17, as you can see, with 11 and a half to go. Falcons have just been on a pretty good run. At one point, it was 13 to 12 in that first half, and then Brookwood got a last four and a half minutes. They got quite a run going. There's a nice shot by Lily Rozeski. Trying to Get some points on the board here. That one just off the front, no good. And we're going to get a call. They are apparently on the line touching the ball. So Brookwood has the ball back. But yeah, 13, so you look at that, that's a 26 to 5, 26 to 6 run here for the Falcons. Brookwood able to pop that one in, and they come right back down the court here. Can't get this one to drop. Blackhawks in a good battle underneath. And we're going to get a jump ball. Wallace battling with somebody there. I didn't quite catch if that was uh, who that was for uh, Brookwood. It could have been Sham, Sam Schneider in there. Wallace kicking it back out. Playing catch. Now you've got uh, Wallace and Emily O'Rourke in the ball game, number 22. Shot is up and good, and Mullenkamp has found the hot hand. She has hit a couple of threes, maybe even three threes now. I've kind of lost track here. But she has been uh, red hot. Here's a drive. That's up and good. 
10 minutes to go in the game. And the ball lost here. There's a nice hustle play by Dregny. Tipping the ball away from Ruby Mullenkamp. Otherwise, the way she's shooting, that would have been an easy two. Anderson will look to inbound once again. Shot is up. That's no good. Monkamp just a tad strong and to the left side. <coughs> Baroqua heading down the court and they'll come back quickly here. Lob pass over the far side. Anderson, no good on that shot. And we're going to get a reach in. And I think that one's going to go on Ruby Mullenkamp. Just a little too much on that one, reaching in. Blackhawks, here's Moylene. And they'll get the ball across the timeline. Anderson, bounce pass to the far side. Mullenkamp, back to Mullenkamp, down low. Here's Anderson. And uh, that shot off a little bit. We're going to get a whistle here. Some contact underneath. They'll put Anderson to the line. Well, Vanessa usually a pretty good free throw shooter. Let's she, see what she does here. Her first one is going to roll off the left. Second one will pop through. And a quick uh, substitution. Now they're going to get the play ready. Ball goes into Dregney. Nearly lost it, able to recover. Trying to go between the legs here of Anderson. And now we've got bodies on the floor, and Dregney comes out of there. Well, that was a pretty good hustle there. Just getting that ball out from underneath everybody. Brookwood bringing the ball back across. Then the Blackhawks come out on the defense. Mullenkamp back up to the top here. Trying to get underneath here. and We're going to get a whistle and a turnover here on Brookwood. Well, into the ball game now for Brookwood, number 12, in Sophie Hyatt. Playing a lot on that JV, but she gets an opportunity here on the court now, varsity-wise. Trying to get the ball out here to uh, Dregney, and it's going to go off her hands. Eight minutes to go in the ball game, and Brookwood in a, well, comfortable spot, I guess you would say here, with that 27-point advantage. Anderson directing traffic. O'Rourke trying to set a screen, but they'll go the other way, back up to the top here with Hyatt and Anderson. Dregney coming out, and there's a pass. Defensively, there was Moyleen, who nearly came up with the pickoff. Back up to Anderson once again. Here's a little move, but uh, going to be down on the floor. 
Nice try, just couldn't quite get there. And Varokla coming back strong. Here's a good shot. That's going to be just off the front of the rim. And the ball tipped away. That might have been Ruby, or was that Reagan? Reagan Mullenkamp, I believe, down low. Tipping that one away from everybody. So Varokla and Sam Schneider. Nope, it's going to be instead Emily Hubach that will look to inbound. Hubach over here on the wing. Back up to the top with Schneider. And she kicks it to the left side. Dragney from Hubach. Here's Moylene on the drive, and she gets double teamed, finds the teammate in Hubach. Hubach with the shot, no good, off to the right, and the rebound. We're going to get a foul underneath as Emily Hubach winds up on the floor. Somebody caught her from behind, and let's see who that somebody might have been. Might have been Molly Hansen, number 11. That's who it was. So Hansen with a foul, that is the fifth team foul on the Falcons. Rokla underneath their own basket, not able to get that one to go. It was tipped out of bounds by Brookwood. Dregney was in there looking for the shot. Back up to the top, picked off. That was a work, I believe, coming up with, uh, was that Wallace? It was Wallace coming up with the uh, steal. Not able to get that one to go. Here's a nice layup. Good hustle there by Hubach to get the bucket. Broke out in front of the pack and nice pass. Mullenkamp. Moving from the left, now going to the right, back to the top of the key to Anderson. Anderson slowing things down. Over to Hansen on the far sideline. And now a timeout here by Brookwood. Well, the timeout here on the floor by the Falcons as they want to uh, kind of make sure that they had everything lined up. Coach Travis Anderson putting in some of the younger players here. Again, head coach Terry Cena for the Blackhawks. Tell you what, a young bunch that they just keep battling here. You love that attitude that they're not going to give up. Here's the uh, pass. They'll kick it back out. Shot is up, and that's going to drop for Brookwood. And that'll extend their lead here, 49-22, with five minutes remaining in this ballgame. Shot is up, no, weak side rebound coming away by Mullenkamp. And uh, she can turn and bring the ball down the court. Over to Powell, back up to the top with Ruby. Shot is up, that's no good, and rebound, it's going to be pulled down here. Let's see what the call is. Emily O'Rourke inside, <coughs> but she might be called for uh, over the back here, I think. Uh, had a little better position in there. And uh, O'Rourke will come out of the ball game after that foul. Miranda Art set to come in for the Falcons. Hubach back up to the top with Deal. Deal making a little spin move. Her layup attempt, no good, and we do get a foul underneath as she went for that drive right down the lane. Nice little move here by Rachel Deal, and she'll go to line after the foul by Reagan Mullenkamp. So Reagan with four fouls now, and... Rachel will pop that one through. Art comes into the ball game. That uh, second shot a little bit strong, but 
Christensen with a nice rebound. Here's a shot up, no good, and a weak side rebound tipped away uh, right off the hand of the Falcons. And Ruby, uh, yes, Ruby Mullenkamp down there. Roqua gets the ball in, Christensen, far side it goes, and just off the fingertips of Sam Schneider. Well, a quick pass there as Christensen saw the opening, but uh, Sam not able to get there quite in time. Well, we're under four minutes to go in the ball game, and the Falcons look to come away with another win on their year, having a very nice year. Meanwhile, there are some growing pains here for Baroqua, but those growing pains down the road, you're going to watch uh, this team get better and better as uh, they continue to, to work as a unit. Here's Anderson. She'll put this one up, and that'll drop. Well, I would imagine here's a shot up, and that's going to be a little bit short. And we'll get uh, some more substitutions coming in. Wholesale substitution now for the Falcons with 3.12 to go in the ballgame. Schneider will look to inbound. Again, underneath their own basket. They do go inside to Dio. Her shot is up and good. A nice bank shot here for Rachel Dio. Coming across the timeline. Hyatt. And we got a timeout. Well, the timeout here. And uh, just trying to get everybody situated. Falcons. Bringing in a whole new crew here. Let's take a look. You've got Hyatt, who will inbound. Hanson, number 11. They'll get the ball in. Wiedemeyer. Back out to Wiedemeyer, and that one scooted right past her. Also, into the ball game, uh, let's take a look here. I think we had... Uh, yeah, Kinsley Holmquist into the game for Brookwood. 2.45 to go. Christensen stopping. That ball blocked by Hyatt, and it goes out of bounds. Hubach to inbound. Gets it into Moylene. She's left wide open, and the lefty's shot just off the mark here. But tracking the ball down, that's another good hustle play there by Emily Hubach. Christensen, needing some help, gets it up to uh, Hubach, who spins to her left side. Her lamp is just off the front. Let's see what do we have here with the whistle. Looks like uh, Hubach will go to the line here and shoot a couple. Uh, off from that drive. Shot is going to rim out. Art will come into the game. Hubach with the second free throw pops that one. Here's Hansen. Now Arndt and Hansen, they'll play catch for a moment. Looking to go inside, they do get it to Hyatt, back out to Arndt. Miranda on the far side with a bounce pass, trying to go into Hyatt. That was, I believe that was Wiedemeyer, yep, it was, with the shot, uh, excuse me, with the pass. 
Now Hyatt, bouncer pass, down low to Holmquist, and we got a jump ball. Well, getting the hands in there, that was Hubach. Not going to give anything up easy there, right? And here comes Varroqua to the right side. Down to a minute 40 to go. That pass, oh, a little too fast. And off the hands of uh, Christensen. They'll get the ball into Arndt. Across the timeline here on the wing with Hansen. Hansen fakes right, goes left, back to the right side, now on the pass. Inside goes to Hyatt, kicking it out. Again, the triangle here, Wiedemeyer and Hansen over to Arndt. Arndt lost the handle. Good defense there by the Blackhawks, and they head the other way. Well, one minute to go in the ball game, and Quackenbush gets that free throw. She has another one coming. Well, happy holidays to everyone. As, boy, Christmas right around the corner. Shot off the front of the rim, no good. And we'll go back the other way. Well, a turnover here by the Falcons. And Mylene is going to get the drive. And a layup there on a tough play. Thirty-eight seconds remaining, and the Blackhawks still trying to play hard here in this ball game. That ball will rim out, so the three-point play not able to take place. Well, looking at tonight's ball game, we can tell you that for the Falcons, as we're under thirty seconds to go and the turnover again, that uh, Vanessa Anderson and Ruby Mullenkamp both with uh, seventeen points tonight. Boy, they played very well in uh, this soon-to-be victory. Let's take a look here scoring-wise. Emily Hubach led the way with eight points for the Blackhawks. They will drop this home contest. And let's see who else. We had uh, Krakenbush with five and Lily Rzeski with five as well. Well, again, uh, Merry Christmas to everyone. We hope that you enjoyed watching this Western Wisconsin video production of Viroqua Girls Basketball as time begins to run down here in this ball game. Have a safe and happy new year as well.